Good morning, Northumberland. I'm Taylor. And I'm Sky. And these are your morning announcements. Grade 12 French students who submitted an expression of interest for the DELF exam back in the fall should have received an email Monday to register for the exam. Registration closes today and this is a hard deadline, so don't miss out. If you've not received an email, you need to see Madame Chismack ASAP. Hey parking lot users, the amount of Dairy Queen trash in our parking lot is concerning. We would appreciate it if you kept your unhealthy eating habits contained in the garbage cans provided. Thanks. Mathletes, third time is a charm. We have a meet scheduled for next Thursday, March 5th at CEC. Please let Miss Beaton know ASAP if you can attend so you can be registered for this event. The following students have not passed in their Chem 11 textbooks. Jessica Stewart, Brandon Cameron, Victoria Robertson, Maddie Young, Sydney McKinnon, Ray Chisholm, Mitchell McDougall, Megan McKenzie, McLean Tobin, Emily McGinnis, Haley Brophy, Jenna Graves, Nick Kerrigan, Kale Bombi, Emma Burnham, Megan Pedawa, Rain DeCoast, Min Jae Jung, Maya Kay, Georgie Gunn, Joe Zubon. Please return these ASAP. Pre-IB and IB applications are available in room 1024 and student services. Squawks Cafe is celebrating the closing of African Heritage Month. Friday, our $5 lunch special is a Kenyan dish called Kuku Paku, served with couscous or steamed rice. Kuku is a Swahili word for chicken, while Paka is a Punjabi word for delicious. This coconut chicken curry dish is a testament to the fusion of our foods by way of trade in our world. Curry, an Indian spice, probably first made its way to Nova Scotia from East African via Caribbean islands such as Jamaica. Our coconut chicken curry dish is gluten-free. We also offer a vegan option made with tofu. For dessert, we are serving ginger cake. This is a molasses ginger cake originating in Congo and brought here by enslaved Africans. We are also serving lime cake from West Africa. These past two weeks, we have been offering free samples of special recipes we are trying from the continent of Africa, such as shiku, shiku or coconut balls a sweet tasting Nigerian snack that has found its way to other neighboring countries in West Africa and around the world. South African pepper cookies. So South African pepper cookies are popular around the world. The South African chocolate pepper cookies are exactly what the name describes. A chocolate cookie with a little black pepper to enhance the chocolatey flavor. Ginger cakes from Sierra, <laughs> Sierra Leone. Don't be fooled, these aren't your typical Canadian cakes. These are a small, dense, biscuit-like pastry made with ginger and cayenne pepper. Drop by and sample a treat. Best of luck to Northumberland girls hockey team at their provincial championship in Bridgewater this weekend. We know you guys will do fantastic and bring home the gold. Attention grads, listen up. We will be having a very important ma mandatory meeting today at first break in the theater. It won't be long, but lots of important information will be discussed, so please show up. Music news. Choir students are encouraged to go to the game today at lunch. Go Northumberland! Music trip goers are reminded that their February payments are due now. And there's and one week till Hockey Provincial, so everyone come on in. <laughs> and, and that's, that's been, been your Hawks Northumberland. Northumberland. Call. Call.